What's up guys welcome back to yet another video Just few days back we received the first stable build of Oxygen OS 12 and Color OS 12 for OnePlus 8 series Today we have the second update rolling out for OnePlus 8 8 Pro and 8T but this time it's based on Color OS 12 which is the second stable build So in this video let's check out what all changes they have done with this latest build of Color OS 12 for OnePlus 8 series So without wasting any more time let's get started So here I have my OnePlus 8 on which I've already installed ColorOS 12 latest stable build. If you talk about the software information here you can see Android version is Android 12. We still get 5th March 2022 security patch and if you talk about the version for OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro the version is C.14 but for OnePlus 8T the version is C.21. Previously we had version C.17 for OnePlus 8 Pro. Now a direct jump to C.21. And before moving ahead, let's keep a like target of 500 likes on this video. We still have 80% of users who haven't subscribed to our channel, but they do watch our videos. So if you guys find our videos helpful to you, then do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. First, let me tell you about the installation process. So guys, I have also mentioned the installation process in the description below. Make sure to check that out if there are any confusions. And if you are running Oxygen OS 12 stable build on your OnePlus 8 series, then you won't be then you won't be able to perform a local upgrade over stable build of Oxygen OS 12. To install Color OS, you first need to downgrade your device to Oxygen OS 11 and then you can do a local update. I'll provide all the download links in the description below including the full zip file of Color OS 12. The size will be approximate 4.5 GB. And now let's talk about the benchmark results. So here with Geekbench application single core have scored 915 and multi core have scored 3121. With Antutu benchmark application my OnePlus 8 have scored 681235. We also did CPU throttling test and I did notice bit of throttling issue wherein max CPU throttled up to 78%. We did throttling test only just for 15 minutes. And guys if you are installing Color OS for the first time you'll see lot many Chinese applications pre-installed. and some of those applications can be easily uninstalled by long pressing on the apk file or you can say application just tap on uninstall and you will be good to go but there are some applications which cannot be uninstalled take a example of browser if you tap on app info here you can see you don't have an option to disable it and even uninstall it so for this we have made a detailed video on how to disable or uninstall system applications without root You can check out the video which is being displayed on the screen. And right now if you guys ask me which OS do I prefer, Oxygen OS 12 or Color OS 12, then I can anytime say Color OS is way better compared to Oxygen OS 12 in the current situation. Future I know things will be changed and we'll have better Oxygen OS for all OnePlus smartphones. Also we don't get this blur effect while pulling down the notification panel on Oxygen OS 12, but here you can see the blur effect which looks really great. And if you are installing Color OS 12 over Oxygen OS 12, you'll have all the Google applications working fine on Color OS 12. So let me show you. As you can see here, we have Play Store. Let me download an application and show you guys. So let's just download MX Player. And as you can see, we don't have any kind of issues downloading the applications from Play Store too. We do get this wallpaper based color theming stuff on Color OS 12 which you can find it here in the personalization section user interface here you will find an option called colors which says wallpaper color picking so according to the wallpaper device will apply the theme or you can say change colors on your device basically OnePlus isn't adding new features but they are completely working on fixing all the issues what users have been facing with Android 12 So if you take a look at the change logs which are completely related to system and camera. With the first change log OnePlus says they have optimized the overall performance of the device. So till now I did not see any kind of lags or jitters while using the device running Color OS 12. Though this thing we cannot confirm right now, we need to use the device for a day or two. After that they have also improved the charging speed of the device. Though I personally never faced any kind of charging issues on previous builds of Color OS, but there might be some users who have faced this issue. but oneplus have completely fixed this so right now i have 41% i'll try to drain this battery today and evening i'll upload the stats on twitter 
or on a telegram group about how much time device takes to completely charge from 0 to 100 and also i'm not sure whether this feature was present on the previous build where you can set a specific battery level to trigger power saving mode so if you guys are already running first stable build of color os then do let me know in the comment section below whether this feature was present on previous builds or not from where you can set this specific battery level to trigger power saving mode also on previous build, I did notice bit of issues while unlocking the device with face unlock but I think on this build it has been taken care and till now no issues to be seen while unlocking the device using face unlock which is now pretty much faster and accurate. Later under system oneplus I have also fixed some applications display issues. So this I never noticed on the previous build. If any one of you guys have noticed then do let me know in the comment section below. After that last issue is layer to camera application wherein oneplus have fixed this notification issue of camera running when people used to open camera application. So that time there used to be a notification in the notification panel which had this message of camera running. And as you can see camera application is running now and we don't have any notification in the notification panel. So guys these were all the changes what oneplus have done with the latest build of color os 12 for oneplus 8 series. If you guys still have any kind of questions later to this latest build then do let me know in the comment section below as of now only this much in this video i hope you guys like the video if you like the video then do give me a thumbs up and also if you are new to our channel then do not forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching have a great day